Hey there, this is Marissa with Marissa Moments. So the download is this. What I heard is when you foster the disease, you encourage the dis-ease, right? Now let's break that down because what I receive is that we keep encouraging like almost like an illness within ourselves, the things that we accept, the things that we um, not only encourage, but it's like we elongate, we we stoke the fires and flames of our discomfort, the of our toxicity, trauma, all of these different things. And then we wonder why we are constantly sick. And not necessarily just physically sick, because I do receive like that is a, a way that um, the disease will manifest itself, right? Is physical discomfort and just illness, right? But the other thing is just like mentally sick, um, emotionally sick, just feeling drained and exhausted. But what I receive is that that's coming from within. That's we have to take our own accountability in the matter because we are the ones that are encouraging this disease. The disease will lead to dis-ease. <laughs> and that's us living from our wounds. But we're all, so here's the thing. We're all working from our wounds, right? But as we're on our healing journey, as we're looking at um, taking our own accountability, as we are almost like putting um, trauma and toxicity under a fine microscope in order to break it down and and. Uh, eliminate the false components and and only hang on to the things that actually are prosperous for us and that teach us that our learning experiences as we do that we enable ourselves to separate from the disease <laughs> and I feel like I'm talking in circles here so the bottom line to this bottom line is take accountability and stop creating situations and circumstances under which you feel as if you become a victim just to have something to complain about. Stop running back into the fire and then complaining about receiving third degree burns. Stop encouraging relationships that you know send you on unhealthy spirals. Stop looking to go into places and spaces that do not encourage your growth or uh, do not allow for you to be authentic. I don't know how many more examples Spirit wants me to give, but I'm about to run out of time. So the bottom line to this bottom line, again, is stop encouraging the disease. And then you'll find your comfort.